Hey everyone, so I know I've been completely MIA from making videos and um, I deleted all the videos I had on my channel and I know that they got a ton of views and I have almost 500 subscribers from those videos um, but I just wasn't happy with the videos that I was making. I wanted to go in a little bit of a different direction with my channel and yeah, life is just a little bit different now and I just wanted to change up the way that I'm doing things. So today I'm back and I'm going to be filming a haul for you guys because I'm going on a vacation for eight days in North Carolina and I'm going to be doing like a road trip. So I went to some stores, picked up some new clothes, got a suitcase and some other things. And yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys what I bought. It's a little bit of a collective haul because I went to... Um, some stores on different days, but mainly most of the stuff I bought yesterday. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get into the haul and I'm also going to be doing it like try on style so you guys can see the things that I bought on and see how they look. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the video and thank you so much okay, for watching. Okay, so the first place I went was Target, my all-time favorite store. I mean, like who doesn't love Target, right? Um, and I got a ton of stuff at Target, like a ton of like necessities. Um, like shampoo and conditioner and stuff like that so the first thing I got was this Conair brush and I used it today so that's why it has hair in it but it's just black and gold and it's just a paddle brush because my hairbrush um, was like ripping my hair because the little um those little like ball things were breaking off so I went and got a new hairbrush and then I got these SteriPod clip-on toothbrush protectors. I've heard good things about these just because I'm traveling and I want to protect our toothbrushes. So yeah, I got these. Hopefully they work well. Um, the next thing I got was this Schick Intuition razor and um, it's just really big like good white razor and gold, with this so on it this is like the most amazing razor in on the face of the planet and I love it so I got that and then I got the method pure naked moisturizing body wash in magnolia with aloe vera and this smells really really good and um, method doesn't test on animals so I found this and I was really excited and I'm really um, happy that I found this and I'm very excited to try it. Okay, so the next things I bought were from the Yes2 brand and I believe they don't test on animals still, so that's awesome. But I got the Yes to Carrots Nourishing Daily Cream Facial Cleanser. I just needed a new face wash and I love Yes to Carrots. I think it smells really good. I've never used a face wash, but I've used the shampoo and conditioner, and it worked wonders for my hair, so I thought that this would be good. And then I got the Yes to Cucumbers Soothing Daily Calming Face Moisturizer, and I really needed a new moisturizer because mine was like an old, it was just old and like in a um, container, so like I was sticking my fingers in it, and it just probably was not good for my skin, but they still had the cruelty free bunny logo on the back so I'm pretty sure they're still cruelty free I know there was a little bit confusion about it but they are still cruelty free and then I got summer's eve products ladies you know what these are for um, and then I got the organics weightless hydration coconut water shampoo I've never tried this exact one I've tried a ton of different organics um, like shampoo and conditioners but I've never tried the coconut water one so I went and got that and I thought that it smelled really good. I love the smell of coconut but I think it tastes disgusting which is like kind of strange but whatever. And then I got the Ever Straight Brazilian Keratin Therapy Conditioner and I got a big bottle because we all know we go through conditioner fast and faster than shampoo. Got so the organic got that Argon Oil of Morocco Volume Mousse, and this is medium hold. I just have um, naturally very curly hair, so if I'm going to wear my hair natural, I always put this mousse in it and then blow dry it with a diffuser. So I just need a new mousse, and I need to get hairspray still, but I'm going to get that today because um, Target doesn't have the hairspray that I use, so yeah. Um, okay, and then I got these 
Lara bars. I love Lara bars. This is like kind of random. I just saw them and I wanted them. But they're vegan um, fruit and nut food bars. And this is peanut butter chocolate chip. And I already ate three of them. So that really says a lot about my life. But yeah, these are delicious. I got two packs of my favorite gum, the Wrigley's Double Mint, because if we're going to be traveling, you're going to need gum at some point. So, got that. And then I got a few NYX Studio items. Perfect Photo Loving Primer, just because I really never use primers, but I also noticed that in the summer my makeup sweats off, like if it's really hot out. So I figured I would just get a primer, especially if I'm going to be in North Carolina, it's like 100 degrees every day right now, I'm going to need a primer. So I got that primer from NYX, and then I got this e.l.f. Clear Brow and Lash Mascara. I used to use this all the time um, to just hold my brows down because they literally just do whatever they want, like they have a mind of their own. So I went and picked it up again just because they've been getting on my nerves lately. So I got that, and then I got my toenails painted white the other day and the polish is chipping off so I don't want to get another pedicure so I got the Sally Sally Hansen nail polish in tag you're it so so I that was everything that, that I got at Target and now I'm going to move on to Barnes & Noble I went and picked up a nook and if you don't know what a nook is it's just like a a um, e-reader like you can buy books on it and it's like it looks kind of like an iPad, but you read books on it, and it's really neat. Like, I'm reading this book, um, When Bad Things Happen to Good People, and this is just good so I don't have to carry books around, and, you know, I don't have to waste paper. I can just buy them right on here, and they're cheaper on here, so I got that. And this is the Nook Ultra Glow Light, I believe it's called, and yeah, I just got a little gray case for it and I love this thing and this is really awesome I went to Marshall as well and I picked up a dress I only picked up one thing there I was looking for a bathing suit but I didn't find a bathing suit and left with a dress <sighs> shopaholic problems but it's just this a black and white striped dress and it's pretty short but I think it's really cute and it's from the brand soprano um, so yeah I really like this dress and it was only like 20 bucks or something. New clothing items and some jewelry. So the first thing I got was this like um, strapless top, tube top, I don't know, whatever you want to call it. And it's just black and white striped. And it's actually wet right now because it was in the washer, so I just like pulled it out to show you guys. But yeah, this is really cute, and it was on sale for five bucks. I love H&M. Their clothes are so cheap. And then I got this little black um, flowy dress. Um, I would wear this as like either a nightgown or a swimsuit cover-up because it's a little, it cuts down too low to wear like with a bra. So yeah, but it crisscrosses in the back and it's really cute and simple. And then I got and I this like really cute tank top dress, which is like tight and goes down like around my knees. And I think it's adorable and just really, ca really casual and comfy and very summery. I love this um, color I think it's gorgeous on like some tan skin it looks good but yeah this one's a little bit shorter than the other one but very cute number this pack of earrings and it just has two little roses um, some hearts some anchors and then these little bows and um, I wanted to get some like little packs of earrings like this because I got my second holes pierced and I have yet to change them I've had them pierced for a few months now so I wanted to get some earrings to wear in my second hole so I just got some little dainty ones and then also at H&M I already took these out of the little um, 
packaging, but I got these gold dangly earrings, which I think are really pretty. Um, I can't wear heavy earrings because my ear holes were stretched out before. Um, I had a weird phase, so I got these really light ones, and I think they're really pretty. Can't wait to wear those. And... Okay, so then I went to Forever 21. The only thing I bought there were these gold leaf earrings, which I think are so cute. They were only like five bucks. And I went to Aldo. Love sunglasses them. were two for 20. I went in there specifically to look for sunglasses because I really need some new ones because mine are I always like, wear aviator good. style sunglasses. So I got these black ones with gold um, detailing and this little braided look on the side. So. <laughs> And then I got these ones, which have the gold detailing again, but these are pink. The lenses and the little so sides are, are also really cute. Okay, so then I went into Sephora because I wanted to get a new, like, foundation or something because I've been buying, like, Wet n Wild and just, like, really cheap ones. And there's nothing wrong with cheap makeup, but I just hadn't bought myself, like, a nice foundation in a while. So I it's, wanted to go ahead and get one. a few one. days from my birthday. My birthday's actually tomorrow. Um, I wanted to go into Sephora and buy something and they'd give me my free birthday gift so it all worked out but I got the Tarte Amazonian Clay BB Tinted Moisturizer and this has SPF 20 in it which is great I, I definitely need that um, and I got it in medium and it's just very light I wore it today um, and it's very comfortable not heavy at all and Hopefully it doesn't sweat off. I think I did get a sample of this before and I really liked it. So hopefully this is the one that I tried. Um, but yeah, I got this and I love it so far. And then I don't use NARS because they do tests on animals. But NAR NARS is the free birthday gift for this month. And they gave me this satin lip pencil in Rikujian, which is like this nude. And then Cruella, which is this red color, which I actually have on today. And I don't use products that are tested on animals, but I don't want to throw them out. So I'm going to use them up and shoes from Macy's. I got these two pairs of flip-flops online. Just these black ones with the bow with the gold detailing. These are so cute. I love these. I get complimented on them all the time. I've been wearing them like every day since I got them. And then these ones are a little bit dirty. But I got the white ones. I need to clean them. But yeah, these are super cute, and I'm got obsessed these with them. Steve Madden Madden Girl um, Polyurethane Patent Leather. So it's not real faux leather. Um, just these black heels, and I think these are so cute. I really wanted some heels in this style, so I got these ones, and then I got another pair from Steve Madden, and I'll show you from they TJ were on Maxx. Sale, so I couldn't pass it up. So I went so to I where that. I bought the most stuff is TJ Maxx. So, like I was saying, I got a pair of shoes from there, and they are these Steve Madden, kind of the same style, but these are not Madden Girl. These are just the Steve Madden brand. And they are just that same faux patent leather, but these are nude, and these are really cute. I love these. Um, I just need to break them in because they're a little bit. I got this purse because so. I have this like weird purse obsession, and I need to have purses in like every color, but they have to be like nice bags. Like I won't just buy like crappy bags. So I found this one, and it's I believe the brand Urban Expressions, and it's a 100% vegan and cruelty-free purse brand. And it's just this really pretty tan color with gold detailing and the inside is cheetah prints. And I actually just bought a white guest purse so I really didn't need another one but I saw it and TJ Maxx is cheap. Okay, so, so then I bought some I clothing items. The first one is this dress and this is by the brand Pink Rose. And it's just this like Aztec print short flowy summery dress and the back is crochet and there is padding so you don't have to worry about wearing a bra and making the crochet look all ugly so i got that and i love this dress it's really comfortable and a bathing suit cover-up it's um, DKNY and it's just a short little long sleeve button-up dress and it's really lightweight and I wore it to the pool the other day so it's just comfortable and something nice to throw on this dress from the suit. brand Montau 
Monteo, I don't know. And it's just maroon and it's like the um, chiffon material but it's not see-through. And it's like high on one side and low on the other side and it's really this um, I wore it to church last week and it's just black and white striped and it's tight and goes down like a little bit above my knees and it's really really cute I love this dress super comfortable and light it's like cotton like a t-shirt so Um, oh, this black and white dress is the brand Loved. Tree Happens, in case you were wondering. Um, but this skirt is from the brand Rolla Coster. It's not like Coaster, it's like Rolla Coster. <laughs> but um, this is what it looks like. It's really cute. I love this bunched up look on the side. Um, and I also got the same skirt in black, just because it was so cute. Like a cobalt blue dress and it was really cute I wore it for my party on Saturday um, you can go check out that dress if you want to see what it looks like it's I have pictures of me in it on my Instagram um, then I got this skirt which is just this really pretty print and it's just um, like a skater skirt and this is actually Hollister so I was really surprised because you don't usually see Hollister at TJ Maxx but it was really cute and I liked it so is the brand Stella Loose and it's just black and gray and it's like a pencil skirt and then has this flowiness in the back which is what the dress looked like that I wore for the party so that's really Target so yeah this is from I also got this at Target it's just a um, cheetah print umbrella it's from the brand totes I think and it's just the umbrella that comes in this little tote and I really needed one because the only umbrella I have is like this big Victoria's Secret umbrella like it doesn't fold up like this so I needed a little fold up one like for my purse or just to throw in the car or whatever um, and then at TJ Maxx, I got this bag. I forget what brand this is, but I just got this clear little plastic travel bag for my makeup brushes when I, I got go on my trip. At TJ Maxx was a suitcase because I personally don't have a suitcase. Like my mom has one, but I don't want to take hers. I want to have my own. So I got this one. It's the brand Sam's Night. And I don't know if I'm going to be able to like show you guys, but I will try. Um, it's just white and gray and it's like huge like look at it compared to my body <laughs> it's giant and I love this thing and it's going to do wonders for all of my stuff oh yeah and I also got this dress from TJ Maxx um, it's just red and flowy and I think it's really cute I'm not sure when, so um, I guess when I watch the footage back, I'll find out when it fell out. That's really weird. That is everything okay. that I got. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'm sorry if I don't have another video up for a little while because I will be in North Carolina for eight days, and yeah. So, 
Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for being patient with me and being so sweet. And thank you for subscribing. Please like this video and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.